Hello, everyone. I'm Josh Erdman, CEO of Torchlight Marketing, and today we're going to dive back into the marketing toolbox. We're going to reach right in. We have all kinds of cool tools in this toolbox. It's what we do and the tools that we use to do awesome marketing. And uh, the one we're going to talk about today is the Grunt Test. So the Grunt Test comes from uh, Donald Miller, and uh, he has this book called Story Brand. And he really invites us to look at things from the customer's point of view. So what is the customer's point of view when they go to your website? He narrowed it down and really simplified it. It clarified everything on what we need to communicate to our customers when their website isn't running too well, um, when their website doesn't convert well. Uh, to be honest, we, uh, on the inside, we, we call it the ugly baby. You know, it's, it's hard. What do you do when you have a client that has an ugly baby? How do you tell them and get them to improve their website. The grunt test has helped us out with that significantly because um, we can use these rules and we can blame Donald Miller for, um, for these rules as well and say it's Donald Miller that fed them. So we have a YouTube video of his uh, that will take you through a walkthrough, but I'm gonna explain it to you shortly as well. Um, the grunt test is the, the three things that you need to do in five seconds. So you have five seconds. Why is there only five seconds? because people want a fast website. They want a really fast experience. So if you follow this rule and you get things fast and your website loads in less than five seconds, not only are you meeting the rules of the grunt test, but you are also um, making Google happy because Google has a reputation. They like fast websites because they know that their um, searchers like fast websites. So five seconds. What are the three things we need to do in five seconds? Number one, we need to let the person know immediately what you do, what you're all about. If you are um, a lawyer, for some reason, there is this uh, stereotypical image and it's a building, big giant building, um, bricks and a lawyer's name. It doesn't say law, it just goes, you know, you know, Stephen Legal, maybe, but it's got a big giant building. The picture says real estate or office space more than it says that they're a lawyer. Uh, that's, that's a perfect example. It needs to be obvious what you do. The second thing is how, as if I'm at the customer, how are you going to make my life better? So if it just says criminal law, and that's all it says, that doesn't give me any indication of what differentiates you. It makes you better in my scenario and why I should call you first. So if you're a lawyer, maybe your play, your differentiator is that you've been in business for 35 years. That's huge. So your is experience and time. Another one could be price. Maybe you are the lowest price lawyer. Uh, of course, you know you get what you pay for, but that's what you're saying is, is that I am competing competitive on price uh, and that there is a market for that. Another one might be, you might be cutthroat. You win the biggest payouts. That's a huge advantage. And if that's you, you should claim it because there's people that are looking for that kind of lawyer. And then another one, for example, might be wins. You might have an extremely, um, uh, amazing ratio of wins on cases to losses. Another reason. So you need to have a unique differentiator. That's the second one. So first one, the site has to load in five seconds and people need to answer these three questions in those five seconds. Number one, what are you all about? What do you offer? Number two, what, how are you gonna make my life better? And number three, um, how do I connect as a customer? What do I do next to in connect and engage? What does that mean? For um, almost all businesses, it's either a phone number or it's a you know, book now or book to schedule button. So these things can't be small. I can't scroll for them. If I have to scroll, you failed the grunt test. It needs to be in five seconds, all on the main screen. So what do you do? How are you gonna make my life better? And what do I need to do as a, as a potential customer to engage? So that phone number, that book now needs to be big, bold, and beautiful. It needs to have a brighter color than all the rest of the colors. It's called like a call to action um, uh, highlighting color that draws people's attention to it. Most times the most valuable place on your website is the top right corner. In your top right corner um, is where your, uh, where your important calls to action to, can be. The other fail on what needs to, what, what's the most important thing for me to do to engage is, is they'll put everything there. So in the top right corner will be the phone number, book now, schedule to our newsletter, find us on Facebook. Um, here's our contact information. Here's our reviews. And they dump everything in there and clutter it. If you have reviews, if that's not the most important thing, don't put it in that valuable spot. Drop it to the bottom. And then, and then pick one. And sometimes one is more valuable or more preferred by the customer. Um, and that would be a call or a form. 
And that's the other thing that we'll see. I'll ask, custom, I'll ask our customers, how do people engage with you more? Oh, well, they call us. They call us most of the time. They call us three quarters of the time. But the phone number isn't to be found. It's a book now button. So I said, well, are you trying to chase customers away or steer them and make it difficult for them if that's what they prefer to do? If that's what they prefer to do, make it easy for them. The most important thing for that in that scenario is to make the phone number big, bold, and beautiful. So that's the grunt test. Um, what we'll do is um, on this video, the, the, well, there'll be a link available to you or a button to click and it'll take you to the Donald Miller grunt test um, demo video as well. We love the grunt test. We quote to it uh, and refer people to it all the time. It's extremely helpful. And if you really um, are interested more about Donald Miller, the uh, book that he, he wrote about that is called Story Brand. Thank you very much for joining us um, with the Torchlight Marketing Toolbox. You can always refer to that and see more toolbox items at uh, gettorchlight.com slash toolbox. Thank you.